Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What was the name of the Scotty dog in the White House in the 1940s? In the 1940s, the White House was home to a very special canine companion of President Franklin D. Roosevelt. This dog was a Scottish Terrier, a breed that had gained significant popularity during this period. The dog was born on April 7, 1940, and was originally named Big Boy. However, President Roosevelt had a different name in mind, inspired by his Scottish heritage. He renamed the dog Murray the Outlaw of Fallahill, after a famous Scottish ancestor, John Murray of Fallahill. This name, though full of historical significance, was quite long, so it was eventually shortened to a more manageable and charming name, Fala. This is the name that the dog became famous for, and it is the one that is remembered by history. Fala was given to President Roosevelt by his distant cousin, Margaret Null Daisy Null Suckley, as an early Christmas gift. Fala quickly adjusted to life in the White House, becoming a constant companion to the president and a beloved figure among the staff and the public. Fala's antics and loyalty were frequently mentioned in the media, and he even featured in an MGM documentary about a typical day in the White House. He traveled with the president to various locations, including military bases and the Aleutian Islands, and was known for his ability to perform tricks and bring comfort to Roosevelt during stressful times. One of the most notable moments involving Fala was during the 1944 presidential campaign, when a rumor circulated that Roosevelt had left Fala on an Aleutian Island and sent a destroyer to retrieve him at great taxpayer expense. Roosevelt addressed this rumor in his famous Null Fala speech, Null, which helped to humanize him and bolster his public image. After President Roosevelt's death in April 1945, Fala lived with Eleanor Roosevelt at their home in Hyde Park, New York, until his own death on April 5, 1952. Fala's legacy is commemorated with a statue at the Franklin Delano Roosevelt Memorial in Washington, D.C., the only presidential pet to be honored in this way. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below and feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.